My name is Matt Hillman. I'm the uh, Wildlife Refuge Manager at uh, Monmoy National Wildlife Refuge. Uh, we are here today with U.S. Coast Guard Air Station Cape Cod um, to transport about 18 tons of supplies and equipment to ultimately renovate uh, the uh, Monomoy Light Station and Keeper's House on South Monomoy Island. Um, we are partnering with the Town of Chatham, the Coast Guard, uh, with Robert Child's Equipment Rental out of South Dennis, and also with the Chatham Airport to accomplish this really important mission. Monomoy, in addition to being uh, you know, the lighthouse itself on an island and eight miles out to sea, um, it's also part of a, a federal designated wilderness area. And as wilderness, we are not uh, permitted to use any sort of uh, mechanized transport. So a, a helicopter is both the safest, most efficient, and also uh, best means to get all of these 18 tons of supplies out to the lighthouse. Otherwise, we're talking about you know, hand carrying about 18 tons of supplies, and that would, of course, take an army to do. So uh, this project would, would just not be possible without the, the help of the Coast Guard and all of our cooperating partners. Basically every one of these pieces of lumber and drywall has a weight that it comes with when it's uh, shipped by the factory. So we actually have that on paper. Um, we don't want to trust that of course completely. So in addition to that, we also have weighed each of these pieces of lumber prior to stacking them. Um, so the helicopter can lift uh, 1,000 up to 3,000 pounds depending on fuel capacity. As it burns fuel it can lift more. Um, that's why we're going to start low at about 1,000 or 2,000 pound loads. As it burns fuel and we continue with the day, we can actually do 3,000 pound loads. ultimate goal is to open the lighthouse uh, for the public uh, use and enjoyment um, for public tours in the near future hopefully and, and also for our, uh, our staff and research needs um, at the lighthouse. We use that lighthouse on a, a daily basis in season and also in the winter um, for wildlife management and wildlife research use. So this is a really important project both for public use and for uh, Fish and Wildlife Service and, and other, other research use.